because I did not know what to post so it was better not to post anything than posting something boring so here I am with the DIY which is very very easy to do I'm doing the transparent CD painting which is uh, you know uh, kind of very easy so without further ado like share subscribe and let's get started I have already done one of the CDs I have made it transparent and I have colored it I don't know what this design is called but a really colorful way I gave a black background then I made uh, different colored stripes of yellow orange and red and I bordered the swirly lines with white so first of all you need to know how to make the CD Transparent. I have already made a part transparent to check it out if it's getting properly transparent or not. So, uh, without further ado, let's change the angle and let's see what materials do we need and what we should do. Uh, normally, what we need is a CD, scissors, paint. I'm using blue, uh, pinkish purple and red which would be this and i have mixed both these colors with white and water paintbrush you can use both the sides if you are comfortable making a dot with the front well and good go uh, go on uh, my circles or dots don't come perfectly and uh, you can also use a cotton bud or swab and tape to make the uh, ct transparent so first of all what we are going to do is we are going to take the scissors and make a small cut in the sticker uh, of the CD like this make it so lightly so that the scratch does not come in front uh, in the CD plastic CD I'm gonna take the uh, piece of tape and I'm gonna show you I have taken a big piece of tape uh, oh, and then I'm going to stick it uh, near the cut or the scratches whatever I'm going to stick it and there it is so if you have more space of gum like mine and not the whole sticker has come out you can just keep it again go on and on and on keep on doing it with the tape as much as you want like this that's my maximum i have to take a new tape for a uh, piece of tape for this most of the uh, sticker has gone except for this part i cannot take it out uh, if you have something like that uh, I'm going to do a background first and then I'm going to put polka dots on it so I'm going to make my uh, background white and then I'm going to put polka dots on it which would be a very very simple design so let's see how the background will be I'm using a creamy white color so let's start I have finished doing my first coat. I'm going to let it dry and then paint a light second coat. So let's wait. I did uh, two coats already and uh, it's dry. Now we're going to do the uh, polka dots. So I'm going. Uh, as I said, I'm going to use 
pinkish purple red and blue so let's get painting so uh, i'm going to start with the purple i'm going to use this cotton bud I have done uh, six, seven, eight, eight to seven to eight uh, dots of light purple, and now I'm going to do the blue color, which would be done by a paintbrush. So let's try it. Sorry for uh, disturbance. You can do this or you can do the uh, way I told you with the back of the paintbrush. Which would make a small little dot. Uh, I'm uh, going to do it with the hand. I'm just going to make uh, four to five dots. Now I'm going to use the red color with the same paint brush. You can also use the other side of the cotton swab or the cotton bud, um, but I'm going to try the paintbrush. If your paints are watery or you use uh, much of water, uh, it would just get mixed up and it would look like a big mess. But uh, practice makes a man perfect. So try to give some space. And if you don't, if you can't give space, just make smaller dots. You can uh, even hang it somewhere uh, from the ceiling and uh, I'm going to give one more polka dot over here. That's all. This is the final result. Uh, so this is a, just a small recap. Uh, I painted uh, the white background and then I put some polka dots for making the um, CD transparent we put a scratch on the sticker and then we put tape and then we pulled off uh, the sticker easily so uh, <clears throat> this was my video for this week I would be coming in with more DIYs and talks every week on Sunday and comment down below which one is better this or this and did you find that mistake yes that was my last polka dot and it had a little too much of water uh, so <laughs> i did not make it necessarily and most of my red paint is coming like this it's drooping but uh, it just needs some time to dry and it would go it would be better i like both my uh, series this was done 
two to three weeks before when it was my holiday time and i was sitting free and i had, had nothing to do and if you want to see more videos like this diys and talks is what i do and comment down below what you want to see more and any suggestions is welcome and uh, dislike if you did not like this uh content so that i know what type of content you like and thank you all for subscribing i am fam i have a big big subscriber family of 60 people and uh, hit that notification bell to be notified every time i come in till we see next sunday you'll be managed sheets